And first of all, I could have sworn I had way more than one outfit, so I definitely. Oh no. Oh, that's why she wants to speak to me. Uncle is, uh. He ain't working. Don't talk to my wife like that. Ah, you always was a cold hearted lizard of a woman. And you always was someone willing to live off the efforts of others. It's Ooh. walk or work, old man. I got lumbago. You'll have more than that in a oh, minute. Oh, John, tell her about my health. Do what the lady says. I worked my fingers to the bone building this place, Abigail Roberts. Marston! Abigail Marston, Miss Marston to you. Miss Marston to you. Yo, John. You gonna let? Actually, been pretty useful. You gonna let him talk to her like that? Sort of way. Who's that? No idea. Friend or foe? I'm not sure. Who is here? Eddie's boys. From Proghorn Ranch. Yeah. Mr. Milton. Mr. Milton. Duncan. Sir, Ma found some old furniture in the attic. I thought maybe you folks would want it as a housewarming Aww, present. Oh, yeah. nice. Uh, That's so regards. sweet. Uh, how kind they are. Tell your mom and pa we're very touched. Where would you like the furniture? Uh, just over here. Then we can arrange. This is real kind of y'all. You saved the ranch. Pa said this is the least he could do. Well, your pa is a fine gentleman. Thank you so much well, for your kindness. I love everything. that. Send your pa my best regards. Tell him he's got friends for life in me and my family. Bye, sir. Ma'am. I can't believe this. How sweet. This is beautiful. It's so kind. Sure. But there's still some more things that we need to get. How about we take a ride into town? It's been ages since we spent any time together. Hell yeah. Yes. I would love that. Let's get the wagon. Me and the missus together. This is so cute. Okay, let's go. I feel like we ain't done nothing together like this since... Since, uh... Since forever? Maybe not forever, but a long time. We ain't had the time, you know? We've both been working hard. And now we got something to show for it. The ranch, Miss Life. It's so nice, John. Well, I'm happy you love it. Get nicer. Look at Abigail. She is so happy and so proud of her man. Now, to my YouTube viewers out there, this is Lover of Ladies. Like my video, share my video, leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys. Most importantly, please subscribe to the channel. That way you'll be able to get daily gaming content from me. May I help you, and my lady? <laughs> definitely click on the notification so you know when I upload my videos. You can also follow me on my Twitch channel at Lover of Ladies 69 Look at them. Now to Blackwater. Beautiful. I like this. Alright. Just me and the missus. Is there anything you want to do? You said there were some things we still needed. We can buy them from that catalog. Let's go have some fun. I know your idea of fun, John Marston. <laughs> I ain't had a drink and... Well... I left those things behind me. No, I mean, good, wholesome fun, like, uh, decent folk have. We decent now? I guess. <laughs> well, decent or not, I still got some errands to run. That's fine. What would you like to do? Maybe get our portrait took, for starters. Portrait? There's a fella in town who takes photographs. You want to stare at a portrait of yourself all day long? I hate to break it to you, but you ain't that much to look at. Damn, Abigail. We gotta bully him like that. Me and you. Okay? Okay, then. Sure. Is there anything else you want? I don't know. Let's just walk around and see where it takes us. I do have to be back by dinner time. Uncle Jack and Charles will manage fine without you. Hell, looking after themselves may even be good for them. They'll starve. No. 
that may be good for him too. Wow, John, you're funny. Charles <laughs> Lido. Don't get my hopes up. <laughs> so maybe you're right. We'll stay. You know I am. Okay then. Tortured it is. Oh, it's a date. Oh, look at John. He basically asked Abigail out on a date. How romantic. And they're getting a portrait done together. Mm -mm. This man has heart eyes for this woman. And guess what? She has heart eyes for this man. You see, I love this. This, uh, this moment of love, you know? We need it. We definitely need more of this. Let me help you down. What a gentleman. Why are you being so courteous? I don't know. Because he loves you, Abigail. He hey, wants to show me. you how much of a great man he's become. I'm going to head to the Drapers for a minute. Won't take long, but I need to get some materials. You want to come with me or wait here? And after that, we can go get our photo taken? Yeah, after that, we can get our photo taken. Aw, that is so cute. Oh, wow. So that's an old photo of him and Abigail back when All they right. were young, that picture taken. young teens. It that much to you. It does. Oh, he's about it to does. propose. Oh, he's about to propose to her. <gasps> that's why. Funny. I am kind of funny. <laughs> A different kind of funny. Am I annoying he you? No. I like this version of you. It just, it just ain't you. Hmm. Well, maybe I've changed. Finally. I don't know. Prob All right. Well, hello, madam. Sir. Hello, sir. How can I help you? We're. We'd like to get our photo taken. Oh, photo. Yes, yes, that I can help you with. Yes. So are you going to do it or so, not? Uh, what do we do? I'm sorry, what did, what did you want? A photo! Listen! Portrait taken. Oh, well, we do that. Yes, wonderful. Handsome couple, quite something, but you need a background. Okay. Background? Yes, we have Niagara Falls. Paris by night. <laughs> we have Mount Vesuvius and its ruins. We have the open prairie. T take a take a look. Pick one. Great, I get to customize my background. Let's see the others. Just pull the lever there. Okay. And release the next one. How about this one? It's dramatic, ain't it? <laughs> Let's see what else they got. Okay, so no grease for us. This is pretty. Or spooky, maybe. Hmm. Let's see everything. Okay, Abigail, let's let's take a look. That's nice. It's like being back home. Is that all of them? I could look some more. This is uh, a saloon. This is a bar. Surely there's a photograph of you in a bar already. Cut well, it out. This was your idea, John. It's up to you. You've seen all of them. Anything you like? You know what? I want to pick the one that she actually likes. Because I want to make this as special as possible. Right here. Just like home. That's what she says. Ah, this one. Wonderful. That will be simply perfect. You know, I wish I had the Congo River. But they require grass skirts. I couldn't afford them. It's just so exotic. You stay mm. there. Hmm. I'll make a pose. That you feel comfortable with? We ain't gonna I'm sit. Dignified. Try to enjoy. I think I'd rather be cleaning the outhouse. Uh. I thought you were a cowboy. A poser. Oh, come on, Abigail. No, I'm a poser. I learned from the best. That is true. Uh, no, that's too dramatic. What about this one? Is that good? Ooh, oh, that's cute. Okay, but I want to see other poses though. What about this one? That might be the one. I feel like that's like the standard cliche pose though. Very good. Oh, 
Wait, I, I, I want to see the other poses. Because I want to make sure it's the perfect one. Nah. I, I want, like, a very... Oh, I like it. A loving pose. Mm, so that one? Natural, particularly you, sir. Ah, uh, you know what? Excellent. No, I like the other pose where it's just uh, him sitting and Abigail's, like, behind him. I feel like that pose is actually pretty cool. Let me just change it a couple more times. No, the other one. Hurry up. This one. How's this? Perfect. Did y'all get it? Or did y'all blink? I'm going to develop this for you. Wait here. Take your time. <laughs> what? Nothing. Nothing at all. Tough guy. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Look at her poking I fun. I didn't say anything. I just posed. Shut up. <laughs> you know, you're not very nice to me. Oh, I'm nicer than you deserve. <laughs> True. <laughs> Here. Came out beautifully. <gasps> sure. <laughs> yeah. yeah oh, look at that face on you. Be quiet. <laughs> What do I owe you? Five dollars. <laughs> do you have five dollars, John? You Thank there you. There you go. I'll see you again. Oh, yes. He'll probably come in for a pose. He seemed to enjoy himself. <laughs> come on, Missy. <laughs> five dollars. I wonder how much is that in today's money. There is one thing I hadn't done. What? I've never been to see one of them moving picture shows. Never. Ooh. No. Well, okay. Let's go do that. Yeah, let's go to the movies. Of course. Hell yeah. It's the marvel of the age. I love Marvel. <laughs> I bet they got some popcorn yeah. too. Well, let's go. I want some popcorn. This is such the cutest day I've ever been in. Like I'm so excited. Come on, Abigail. Thank you. I wonder what movie is Something showing. Sketching for Sweetheart, I think. Oh, hello. Two tickets, please, to see Sketching for Sweetheart. That'll be 50 cents, please. For two tickets? They're What's 25 cents each? I have no idea. By How are you going to work at a movie theater but don't know what the movie's about? Not even a synopsis. Come on in. Mystery. Oh, this is a fancy theater. Woo! This is nice. This reminds me of when I took my missus out on a date when we saw Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. We had so much fun. Wow. So the movie is basically about this guy it's sketching. It's like they're really there. Hey, I'm trying to watch this. John Marston. That's hilarious. What are you doing with that arm? I thought you might be cold. John. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, you know me and trying to make a move on the missus. <laughs> That's women for you. Don't you dare, John Marston. <laughs> I'm watching. I just love how both of them are low-key bullying each other. That's like a really funny John. dynamic right there. Don't be such a sour puss. Oh, she got her own purse. Oh. Stop it. She's a piece of work. Really? Shh. Oh, she is getting everything from this guy. Oh no, the creator. Oh is it over? I think so. That's it. That is hilarious. We never get out. The farm will be fine. <sighs> the farm. I love hearing that. 
Let's go down to the lake for a minute. The lake? Yeah. Sure. Come on. Are you finally going to drown yourself? <laughs> Nerve speaking, I guess I am. <laughs> Happily so. You're acting real strange. No, I'm not. Come on. You're a silly man, John Marston. He's a romantic uh, at heart. What about Jim Milton? Oh, he's even worse. A boat? Conveniently placed right in the lake? He planned this. I don't care what anyone says. He planned like this. I said, mighty strange. I like to row. You know, <laughs> she's saying that, but she's loving it. You can tell. I don't plan on capsizing. I wonder whose boat this is. Uh, I don't know. We'll have it back. Don't I ask don't questions. Think. We're borrowing. Yeah, there don't you go. Or don't jinx it. Good. Ain't it pretty? Let me turn this around just in case if we need to. <gasps> oh my goodness! Okay. Y'all ready? Oh, he's about to propose. I am married to you. No, I mean officially. Proper. Exactly. God. That's Are you right. Serious? I got this ring. I've had it for a long time. He Take wants it. you, Abigail. Look at that. How? Wow, that's such a Are pretty serious? ring. It would make me very happy. If you would... We've lived a lot of lives. Let's just live this one from now on. You and me, Jack, a family, by law. John, I never... I didn't know what mattered to you. Well, it does. It didn't. Damn. But now it does. Okay, John. Woo, you saved yourself right there. I was about to say, damn. This is dumb. Shut up, you silly man, and kiss me. <laughs> uh, she's happy. Aww. Couple goals right there. Look at that. That is so beautiful. That is such a happy moment right there. In fact, that's been the happiest moment I've ever seen in a long while. Finally, John is actually having the life that he always wanted. I'm proud of him. I really am. Damn, I wish Arthur was alive to see this. I really want to know what Arthur would say. <laughs> Seeing that John proposed and John's an actual married man now. Good stuff. Good stuff. Seems like the past is finally in the past. A distant, horrible nightmare that he's finally able to wake up from. I am so proud of you, John. The character development is exquisite. It really is. Princess Brea rescued. Sir Galsworthy put down his sword and, and took up his plow. He became the greatest apple farmer in the kingdom. Men used to travel all across Europe to eat his remarkable apples. But deep inside, he missed the dragons almost as much as they gave him nightmares. He and Princess Brea raised seven happy children, and none of them ever knew that their father had once been the bravest warrior in the world the end wow good job that is so beautiful i love this i really do and this house look at the furniture love it i truly love it beautiful Abigail, dear, 
What's for dinner? Already? What's for dinner? Away with you, you no good parasite. You cook. Actually, that's not a bad idea. <laughs> John, come out here. Whoa, who's that? Dude, what what's going on? Hey, John. Oh, thank goodness. Yeah, scared me. I found him. I Who? found Micah. No. Ooh. I got a lead. One of his boys wanted for murdering a woman. Been seen drinking in strawberry. If we can get to him, he'll lead us to Micah. But I gotta go now. You coming? No. He's not coming. I will. That's your business. His business is here. Abigail. Yeah. Yeah, I'll ride with you. No, I'm... <laughs> Abigail. I'm begging you. No! You risk all this? For what? For Micah? All this? Well, this wouldn't exist if it weren't for Arthur, Sadie, and all the folks that fell. If I let him go, this place ain't no more real than... than one of Jack's dragons. I'm begging you. And I'm begging you to understand. Micah needs to be Sadie, put off. This is... Please. Please try to... Abigail. I ain't got no other choice. Keep an eye on the place for me. Micah needs to be put down for what he did. Oh, Abigail. Let's go oh. kill this son of a bitch then. She... I get it, she's scared. She probably thinks this is the last time she'll see me, but honestly, we need to carry out our revenge. I'm doing this for Arthur. Micah's the reason why Arthur is dead. And I'm gonna make sure his ass, his ass is dead too. Which one was Cleet? The big one or the little one? The one with the rat face. My memory is they both had rat faces. The little bastard with the rat face then. Him? <laughs> yeah, he'll talk. You're damn right he will. We owe this to Arthur. I, I agree. Revenge? Yep, I'm he not did. So sure. Especially not at the end. He cared about stopping Micah, and that's what we're doing. There you go, Sadie. Now. And I hear you're building houses. Mm -hmm. When I'm not killing old friends. Micah is yeah, not a friend. Always killing old friends. Old friends and new. Micah is and never a friend. Seems that way. You interested in bounty hunting, Charles? My last assistant <laughs> was put out to pasture. No, that work ain't for me. I, uh, I think I might get out of here. Go north, Canada, find a woman, start a family if I can. I respect that, Charles. That life. Well, I'd like to try. Ooh, hey, John, you've given him the family book. Cut it out, Sadie. Would have inspired him to a life of celibacy and isolation. Wow. You know what, Charles? I respect that, I've though. Been thinking I might get out of here too. Down South America, maybe. It's wild, but less mean, I guess. I'd run protection for a gold mine, or take up with a handsome revolutionary. I don't know. Something. See something else, at least. That all sounds good. Yeah, it all sounds real fine. But we got some business to take care of first. Okay. Hell yeah. Strawberry, this is it. We leave that business then we find it. is nasty Micah. Can't wait to kill this this pig, this rat. Okay, John, Charles, you take the other side of the river. I'll stay on this boat. If we meet in the middle, we would have covered most of the town. Got it. Here, we'll get him. Okay, let's go. I can't wait. John, walk a little faster, please. This is Micah. Hey, hey Cleet. It's been a while. Cleet. Cleet! Oh, Cleet, you stupid, stupid man. Stupid man. Get him, Sadie. There you go. Damn, she really knows how to tackle. Hell yeah. Sure, Sadie. With pleasure. This is for Arthur. Where's Micah? Where is he? Where's the pig that killed Arthur? 
Where is he? Stop, 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 stop. Where is he? You better talk. Where is he? Where's Micah? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Where is he? I ain't seen him. We fell out. Beat his ass. You know what? I'm bored of this. Let's hang the bastard. Hell yeah. Good idea. Oh. Come on, Cleve. Hold on. Bring him up to the gallows. Oh, my neck. Yeah, let's go. Come on. Come on, let's go. Come on, boy. Oh, this is funny. Since you're not going to talk, we're going to hang you because you're useless now. Oh, yeah. You're only making it worse by delaying what's going to happen. Where is Micah? I don't even need any weapons. That's the funny part. I swear. You heard the lady. Get up there. Come here, you bastard. Move it. Come on, move. Oh yeah, this is beautiful. And I love how the cops are not doing anything about it either. Alright, string the no good murder bastard up. Yeah, this is gonna be so funny. Where's Mike? Come on. Where is he? Where's Mike? I already told you I ain't seen him. Oh, you're still lying. You're still He's lying. Right Where's Micah? Talk, or I'll pull this lever. Talk. Come on. No, 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 no. Come on. Come on. Come on. In the mountains. Where? I think he's, he's up in Mount Hagen. You got a whole gang now. Bad man. Doing bad things. I, I tried to stop him from murdering that little girl. We fell out. Honest. Please. I'm, I'm one of the good guys. Huh? One of the good guys? Hang him. Thank you. That's what I thought. Thank you. One of the good guys. Que come culo. Mm. All right, folks. Nothing to see here. Get out. Thank you. Oh man, this is gonna be juicy. Let's go. It's a long ride. Let's finish this. Hell yeah. I've been wanting to kill him for ages. Look at us, three desperados. Charles, Sadie, me. And we're gonna make sure Micah dies. This is for Arthur. Arthur had no reason to die the way he did. But because of Micah, he's gone. And I'm gonna make sure Micah regrets doing that. This pass will take us up into the high mountains. Lead the way. There's an old watchtower up there they might be using for a camp. And if Dutch is still by Micah's side. Ooh. There must be a Ooh, no. Oh, no. Charles. Don't be careful. Oh, shit. Hold on. Let me see. Let me see where he is. Where he at? I don't even see him. Hold on. Is this really a sniper? That's a rifle. No. Okay. Charles, it's okay. I got you. You know what? Let me see. Let me get closer. Okay, now I know. Now I know where he is. Come on, you. No, I need a better gun. Come on. 
Are you not dead still? You gotta be kidding me. No, there has to be high philosophy. Maybe this one. This has to work. Come on. Come on. Come on. How are you not dead? Okay, let me get close. Let me get close. Uh, okay. Right here. Come on. Right here. Did I shoot him? How is he not dead? Oh, this is so annoying. My guns can't suck this much. Hold on. Got you. Come on. Come on! How are you not dead? Oh, this is so aggravating. Let me get my can of beef here. Nauseating. Maybe if I do the pistol. Right here. Right here. Come on, John, hurry up! John, are you not able to shoot him? Hurry up! Oh my gosh. This guy's pissing me off. This. Okay. All right. All right. All right. I got this. Nah, I gotta kill this guy. Oh, I, I hate this game so much. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.